We had another question regarding technique. Uh, Alexei from uh, Ukraine has asked us uh, what to do if I'm all the time in every match when I'm facing good top row, I'm just losing wrist like this. So he's not mo losing too much to side, but he's no, he's, to... he's dropping down, and he says that uh, there's pain there, and it, it hurts, mm -hmm. and he cannot pull. And he said all the time, almost every match, he goes like this. Yeah. What to do then? But uh, I would say that sometimes I do it uh, not because I'm losing, but I'm feeling even more better with this position yeah. against yeah. some uh, some specific types of technique. You you have uh, perfected the style of arm wrestling. I think you just you drop your wrist. And not always. It depends. Uh, there are, there are times when I will keep my keep my wrist position strong and I will yeah. pull through this point. But there will be opponents, and I feel it's, yeah. it's more effective. I have, I, when, when I have pulled you, I never felt that you were standing like this with me. All the time I'm feeling this. <laughs> if, if I'm pulling against... Not a chance to left arm. If I'm pulling against a uh, top roller, who is going high with this position, uh, and I feel that I'm losing this point, and uh, yeah. I, I would like to go here, but I'm, I'm not strong enough to do this. Yeah. And I'm actually not the strongest one with this position. In our gym, I think I have, uh, I have half, well, a big part of my students who are much stronger here yeah, than I am. We have some guys that are yeah. crazy strong there. But, uh, so if I'm not strong enough here, I'm not focusing on this point, I'm doing opposite. I'm, holding strong with my fingers and I'm not pulling so much here, I'm pulling more here. Yeah. I'm isolating my upper you're wrist. You're not fighting for this spot? No. no. Because usually two top rollers when they get in this, they're fighting for this spot. If, if I feel I'm, I'm, I'm weaker here, yeah. I'm attacking as another point. Yeah. So uh, you, you know that uh, in arm wrestling, you will not be able to be stronger in all, all points, but you have to find one point when, where you are stronger than your opponent. And I know I have some other techniques. I'm holding strong with my fingers. I'm focusing more on this one and I'm pulling more with back pressure, with, back pressure, with, 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 fingers, with, yeah. with hand. Basically, yeah. But you have to hand, have good have hand, yeah. cupping or finger strength or hand strength. To get there, yeah. 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 Other, other thing, of course, is to get stronger. Uh, about the style, I think lately there are much more arm wrestlers who have started to use this uh, style, like yeah. um, Totiev, Dobrin, Dobrin, Dobrin uh, Plamen, even Yashevsky, Cvetan, Irakli. Irakli. Yeah. Just right now in the World Championships, there are few who did really, really good and uh, placed in the top. Top three and even even world champions, yeah, who are very good at this. Uh, and to say opposite, uh, some years ago there was a video with Alexei Voyevoda. Yeah, who said that uh, you should never arm wrestle like this. Yeah, yeah, never do like this. So yeah. it's it's not never. It's a, there are no perfect style. It's, no, it's, no, there isn't. It, there's a blueprint on how you should be doing top roll, but everyone makes it yeah. theirs. Yeah, and uh, you. you like you, your style, you developed it to beat basically the Louis, that uh, hook armistice who were yeah. getting inside. Yeah, I, I, yeah. In 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 the beginning of 2000, middle of 2000, I was I was uh, fighting against very strong uh, inside armistice, same uh, Hajumat Zaluyev, uh, armistice from Kazakhstan, armistice yeah. from uh, from uh, other armistice from Russia, and and they all, they all were so good to getting inside. So Absolutely. and I, I felt I'm I'm quite strong enough with my hand and I can secure my hand. So but I have to attack more on the small fingers here. Yeah. That's that's why I was yeah. focusing so yeah. much here, not and, so much on this it, point. It, and if you would be just like high top roll, you would stand here, you would lose here rotation. Even you might yeah. catch some, but you would lose this part of rotation. Yeah. So here, by dropping your wrist and focusing on this point, yeah, you're not losing that. So. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but the question is how to strengthen it, uh, how not to lose it. Yeah. Yeah, so I will show a few of my favorite exercises, what, what I uh, yeah. do but sometimes. Before we, before we go to exercise, it sh should be still the, the style. If you're all the time losing it, maybe change the angle where you're going yeah. inside. Because sometimes, sometimes guys will think that they are doing, they are intentionally going like this. Mm -hmm. So they need to maybe more pronation, more maybe that, but we're going to focus on strengthening this radial 
Yeah. I think I think uh, if, if you find if, if you watch an internet, you can find a lot of videos where. Uh, uh, Devon Larat and uh, even Tautiev and Ilya Izmin and they, yeah. they, are, they are doing some exercise, belt through stop static, knuckles static and lifts. how much they can lift and I think they are going over 30, even, even 40 kilos. Yeah. So yeah. That's a big those, weight. Those that's weights. a big weight. Yeah. I will not show you <laughs> 30, 40. <laughs> Sorry for that. Yeah. Let's get to the exercise. <laughs> First exercise, uh, it's, it's more or less almost in uh, full coordination together with, uh, with angle, with back pressure. Every time you, you lower down, you drop a little bit your wrist. When you lift up and you rise up, you try to rise your wrist as up as well. But you're focusing on this. It will be a radial deviation movement. I'll do for balance few is left as well. Second one is dumbbell. Again you focus on, on your wrist position and movement flexion and even a little bit extension. So you you are not focusing to use lose your upper wrist curling bend back so you're keeping all the time so you, you keep this level and if you feel your wrist is dropping down or your weight is too big or, or your repetitions are too much and you can even statically hold in hold in some position in this bend position in stride position in extend position about this uh, radial deviation, sometimes in arm wrestling our discussions is uh, wrist extension are necessary exercise or, or those muscle groups are necessary to train. And if we talk about radial deviation, we can basically imagine flexors as a two ropes here, extensor muscles as a two ropes here, and if we do radial deviation, then this upper rope of flexors and upper rope of extensors are working together to do this radial deviation movement. That's why extensors are very important in arm wrestling as well. And they help to have a stronger wrist position. And for static, static strengthening, uh, of course, if you're doing uh, some curls with, with dumbbells, you can always focus to not losing this position, but uh, I think kettle, kettlebells are even better. I could choose small ones maybe, but okay, I will, <laughs> I will try with those. Otherwise, they look too small for me. I think it's uh, Mindaugus, one of Mindaugus Terracitis, you know Mindaugus Terracitis from Lithuania, one of strongest top rollers in lightweight category in the world. I think it's, this is one of his favorite. Uh, you can even uh, stop for position in, and hold a little if you want. Yeah. So Mindaugus is uh, training so much with those kettlebell and kettlebells and having so strong this wrist position that I'm not trying to fight with him in this position. He has super good yeah, Super that's actually where he is very, very solid and very strong yeah. in this if, upper And wrist. if you try to hold him there... Yeah. Just we, we, did, we did a sparring with him a week or two ago and uh, I felt like, uh, no, that's not the position you want to fight with him if you fight with him. Like I said before, use some other angles. If, if you feel that in, in, in that position your opponent is stronger, yeah. why, try, why, try to why find to, some other way. Why to fight there? Yeah. Find, but, find where you are stronger. Yeah, but Strengthen that muscle, but just look at your matches and figure out maybe you are intentionally opening up, putting your arm in position where it will open up. Because a lot of guys are doing it in small adjustments, just more back pressure, more wrist, something like that might change that. Mm -hmm. But strengthening that position, especially if your arm is something like that, yep. is very important in, yeah, in winning. Mm -hmm. Hope this helps. If you have more questions, leave a comment down below. Yeah, something similar. Stay strong and love Armisen.